We live in digital times. Screens are all around us, at home and at work, and there is hardly an aspect of modern life that's unaffected by new technology. Artists of all sorts have responded with alacrity to the coming of new media. Artists always do. The most obvious case is photography, where digital cameras have made snappers of us all and has made us distrust the so-called truth of camera-made imagery. Andreas Gursky, one of the world's most prominent and highly prized photographers, is famous for the manipulation involved in making of images like this one, his Kuwait Stock Exchange. One of the questions to be asked is whether the digital revolution really represents a radical departure for the arts, or whether it is just a freshened up toolkit for the creative mind. David Hockney is one artist who moved very early into harnessing technology for original image making, and his Polaroid collages blazed onto the scene in the 1970s. These days, it's his iPad that makes his canvas. This iPad drawing has been inkjet printed for his upcoming exhibition at the Royal Academy in London. Bill Viola is perhaps the most famous of all video artists. This work is called Chris and is a reverse sequence of a man showering. Viola has been using video since its inception, which is now, as Demetrius Daskalopoulos points out, already a 50-year-old technology. Daskalopoulos is an important collector of contemporary digital as well as more conventional art forms. For him, it's important.